In this video, we're going to connect to Google Spreadsheets and pull data into Analytics Canvas. First step is to authorize Analytics Canvas with the Google account that has access to the files and folders you need. You can look on the upper right and that will show you what Google account you're currently logged into. You can modify that if you need to. And this will authorize Analytics Canvas to connect to Google Analytics and your Google Docs. You can give this account a name and you can reuse multiple accounts within Analytics Canvas. You can see up at the top it tells you which account you're connected to right now. And let's get dive right in and get some data. So we go New Source, Google Spreadsheet. It's going to show you all of your files and folders. Let's pick a folder, pick a spreadsheet, and then that's going to download the information from Google and give you access to everything inside that spreadsheet. Let's select the data that we want to import. We'll select the columns and that'll create a block on the canvas and we can see down below the data. You can do the same thing for another uh, spreadsheet, either it's a different sheet within that workbook or, an, or a new one. We'll do a new one. Same thing, we'll pull the columns so that if new rows are added, we'll be able to see them come up automatically. So now we have two data sets from two different spreadsheets. You can see selecting the stub gives you the data underneath. So let's go into one of these and we'll add another block, an export block, and we'll put this data into an Excel workbook that we're going to generate. So if we click on that, we get an export new workbook and here we define where we want the folder to go so we're going to pick just the desktop for this demo and we'll put a bit of a file name in and what this is going to do is generate a new workbook now if we look down below we can see where the data will be going right now it's sheet 1 a1 we go in and do a pick we can put it anywhere we want we'll leave it at a1 that's fine now we'll go and put the other data source and we now have some options. We can put this into a different workbook or we can put it into the same workbook. So if we select down below, we can see those options and we'll pick the same workbook and by default it's going to set it to sheet 2. But again, if we click on pick, then we're going to be able to go in and see uh, where it is. Now we can move to sheet 1 and we can place it there and you can see in yellow there's the data set that we placed before. So now we can see we've got two different sources from two different Google Docs spreadsheets into a single output workbook. Now we need to run the canvas to actually write the data and generate that workbook. To do that, we click the far left run button. And this tells us that we're about to write the outputs to the file uh, and some data has been cached. Do we want to reload it? So we will say, yes, let's reload it. And you'll see that the data is pulled again uh, from Google Docs just to make sure it's as fresh as possible. And then the workbook blocks are now green, meaning the workbook has been created. So if we take a look at the Excel workbook created, there are two data sets. We can write as many data sets as we want into as many workbooks as we want. Uh, I encourage you to go and check out the other tutorials on the site and give Analyze Canvas a try.